Hello, Arjun here from wizards.exe. In this video, we're going to go over how to open up the block programming menu in on your Fire tablet as well as on your computer. So, the first step to doing this is clicking the three dots on the top right of your driver station and hitting Program and Manage. Now, here we have some information. So we have the Wi-Fi network that the control hub is giving off, the password for that network, as well as an IP address, like a URL at the bottom, where it says, um, right there, where it says HTTP colon slash slash 192.168.43.1 colon 8080. So, if you want to connect your computer to the, um, your block programming, you connect up to the Wi-Fi network, to your Control Hub Wi-Fi network, and then using Google Chrome, you have to, um, you go to the HTTP colon slash slash and the rest of that. You can also code blocks on your Fire tablet, so I'm going to show how to get into that menu. So for doing that, all you have to do is click the three, dot, three bars on the top right and click blocks. Now we're going to get to a menu that looks like this, and right now it's empty since we don't have any programs. There's a bunch of options in the top, but the main ones that we're going to need to use are Create New Op Mode, Upload Op Mode, Download Selected Op Modes, and Delete Selected Op Modes. So I'm going to talk about Upload Op Mode and Download Selected Op Modes right now. And so Upload Op Mode is essentially allows you to upload a backup of an op mode, which is a .blk file. And download selected op modes allows you to download op modes um, or programs from a your robot. And so essentially an op mode is a program for your first global robot. I'm going to click the create new op mode and name it test. And make I'm not going to use any sample right now. Now you can see that I have a thing here, so I just hit save op mode on the top, but you can also download op mode in this menu. So now I'm going to hit the back button, and it might take a second to refresh, so I'm going to hit blocks again, and now you can see test is here. Now I can select the op mode on the right, and I can either delete it, or I can download it. There's also the check mark under Enabled, and essentially what Enabled does is it adds it to your list of op modes when selecting a program. So right now the check mark of Enabled is on. So if I back out of this, now if I click this drop down arrow on the right side, I can hit Test and it's in the list. Now if I go back to my Program and Manage menu and go to Blocks and I disable it, it's going to, and so now I can go back. Now it's no longer there. So that that's essentially what enabling does. It ha helps when you have so many different programs. Disabling some of them will make it a little bit easier, even though the program will still be on your control hub. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe and comment or email wizards.exe at gmail.com with any questions. Thank you.